Lawrence Fox and a fellow presenter have been fired from GB News, following his arrest. The channel has said it has ended its employment relationship with Lawrence Fox following comments he made on the channel about a female journalist. They have said their internal investigation into Dan Wooten continues. In their statement, GB News said, Lawrence Fox and Calvin Robinson were both suspended last week pending internal investigations that have now concluded. As of today, GB News has ended its employment relationship with Lawrence Fox and Calvin Robinson. The internal investigation into Dan Wooten continues. It comes after Fox was arrested after his London house was searched by the Met Police on Wednesday morning. The Met confirmed to the Mirror that police officers had arrested a 45-year-old man on suspicion of conspiring to commit criminal damage to Yule's cameras and encouraging or assisting offences to be committed. Fox was filmed as he claimed his property was being searched by police. In a video shared by the Reclaim Party, which was launched by the former actor, he was seen sitting on a sofa as cops raided his home. Fox, 45, was suspended by the channel after he launched a sexist verbal attack against journalist Ava Evans following her opinion on the idea of having a minister for men, which she discussed on BBC Politics Live. The actor branded Ava a little woman and remarked to Dwana Shag that in the disgusting TV broadcast on GB News, which later saw himself and host Dan Wooden suspended. The exchange, which took place on Dan Wooten tonight, has become the most complained about moment on TV this year, according to Watchdog Ofcom. The media watchdog previously confirmed they had launched an investigation into the Dan Wooten show under Rule 2. Three of the Broadcasting Code, in which broadcasters must ensure material which may cause offense is justified by the context. Dan issued a groveling apology in the wake of the backlash over the broadcast, while Lawrence stood firm on his comments, before later issuing an apology to Ava in a 15-minute video shared on Twitter, in which he also slammed GB News and his former friend Dan. Speaking to the camera, he said he knows that GB News are going to sack him, but he wanted to clear his own conscience by apologizing to Ava Evans for using the word shag in his rant. However, he said that he did stand by what he said in telling all self-respecting men to run a mile from her. In the clip, he explained, I went on the Dan Wooden show. I told them exactly what I was going to say and I think that people found it amusing. They knew what I was going to say and I think I did even mention to the producer the use of the word shag, which I don't think is the world's worst word. The point I should have made, was to say that men who are traditionally stoic men should probably avoid women who don't like them very much and women who dismiss male suicide. If I was going to be sensible and I could replay it, I would say that any self-respecting man in 2023 would be well advised to avoid a woman who possesses that worldview because she will probably cause him nothing but harm. But what I did say was, I wouldn't shag that, which is not right. It's demeaning to Ava so I am sorry for demeaning her in that way. However angry I am with her still, I am sorry for doing that. And it demeans me because it's not representative of who I am and also am not saying any of this stuff, I know I'm going to get sacked tomorrow, I'm saying this stuff to clear my own conscience. GB News presenter Deacon Calvin Robinson has also been sacked by the channel. He was suspended after issuing a strongly worded rant in defense of Dan Wooten. I will not be appearing on Dan Wooten tonight without Dan Wooten. Dan Wooten had a significant part to play in building GB News, the 37-year-old wrote on X, formerly known as Twitter. 
he invited me along pre-launch, he also brought so many people on board. Behind the cameras as well as on-screen talent. Including the careerist ambitious ones who are currently gunning for his job. These people are worse than the woke mob, because these vultures are giving the mob ammunition and essentially escalating the channel's demise. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.